Left center field, and this ball's going to get to the fence. Here comes Jansen around third, in to score, and the Blue Jays have taken the lead. Score. Line to left center, and all the way to the fence. Tapia racing around third, is on his way in to score. Espinal does it again. Lead as he had the last couple of pitches. That's a fair ball. And all the way down into the corner. Toppy on his way to third, getting the wave from Louis Rivera. And he will score. Another RBI double for Espinal. At an OPS of 877. Alvarez off to a slow start in terms of average, but not power. And there's a great catch by Santiago Espinal diving to make that play for the second out. Oh my goodness, the pitcher's best friend right there. An outstanding play by Espinal. He's playing him in the shift. He's playing deep. Watch the jump he gets on this ball. Looks like for sure it's heading into the outfield for a base hit and two runs. Full extension. High and deep to left field. Espinal has hit it well, and it's gone. First of the season for Santiago Espinal. As he takes Verlander deep and gets the Blue Jays back within a run. He's been having some good swings. Remember his first time up, he found him a lot of sliders away. Ended up striking him out. Espinal finish it off. The 2-2 to Espinal. And he has hooked it down the left field line, and it is gone. Second home run in as many games for Santiago Espinal. And the Blue Jays have taken the lead. Yeah, you can smile about that one because that's a thing of beauty. As soon as he hit first base, he was yep. First couple of years of his career, and going back into the minors in college, he was a four-seam guy. As that one is knocked up the middle. What a play by Espinal. What a throw by Espinal. Boy, a fantastic effort on both ends of that play as Espinal does it again. Speechless. <laughs> Speechless. Oh I'm just going to let you watch this play again and enjoy it. I don't have to say anything. Can't be done any better than that. Now I will. That's <laughs> right. That is outstanding, young man. Little infield dribbler that just died, and Garcia couldn't throw him out. The next guy homers now Espinal he's doing more damage off the base of the wall and left center Tapia to third on his way home there will be no throw Espinal does it again to right field this could be trouble this ball's down Tapia around third heading home Espinal into second it is five to three. Loop to center, and it's dropping for a base hit. Here comes Vladdy, and he will score. The 2-0. Lined in the left, a base hit. Chapman getting the wave. Alvarez's throw, not in time, and the Blue Jays take the lead. They're not, but if that pitch was a strike. Espinal drives it to the gap in right center field. That'll split Mercado and Reyes and go all the way to the wall. Chapman is in to score. Espinal speeding towards third. The relay in time. And he gets into one. Driven to left field. And it is signaled as a home run. It is gone. A three run shot for Espinal. And I'm sure the Yankees will. They only. It's only been kept track of since 2016. Ground ball through the middle. 
play at the plate. Not in time as Gurriel. The rest of the infield backed up. And Espinal gets a hold of one. He's hit it pretty well. It is going to go. What an answer for Espinal and the Blue Jays here to lead off the bottom of the first. You hit a home run from your leadoff batter. We can do that. <laughs> Pollock. And a base hit into right center. This is trouble for the White Sox. Tapia's on his way to third and getting the wave. Relay throw to the plate. Not in. And he's got a base hit into center. A two for four afternoon for Espinal. Zimmer up to second. George Springer out again with the non. Yes, he can. Lines it in a right for a base hit. And two runs will score on the play. Biggio and Chapman are both racing. One, six to five. Espinal. Deep left field and gone. And it's not over just yet. Eight to six. Crazier things have happened. There at first base. And now Espinal with a fly ball deep left field, and this one is gone. The power surge continues for the Blue Jays here at Kauffman Stadium. Their third home run of the night as they now lead six to nothing. And that decision was a good decision by Kirk just to sit there and let Espinal come up. Santiago. Three home runs tonight. Bouncer to the right side and threw a base hit. Vladdy getting the way from Luis Rivera on his way home and he will score. An RBI single for S. Got jammed. It's going to drop. Guerrero to score. Hernandez behind him. It is six to nothing. Two on and two out on the 2 2 to Espinal. Little flare, and that's going to drop in. Everything is falling tonight, and here comes Kirk to score from second. Around he still does maybe have to worry about giving away location because there's a runner out at second that's base right. again. So just stay in the middle of the plate. Up the middle, long throw. Espinal dug out by Biggio. Another good play. Stars all over the infield for the Blue Chase again this afternoon. They get in on Aaron Judge. And Espinal showing off for his arm strength. Oh, helping him feel a little bit better, no doubt. Trying to dig himself out, really, from his first slump of the season. And this will make him feel even better. An RBI single into right center field to bring in Guriel and make it 4-1. to one. There they go. And it's grounded up the middle of base hit. Kirk can easily come into score on this. Around the third is Tapia, and the Blue Jays have a one to nothing lead. Strom sets. And the pitch. And a liner into left center, a base hit. In to score, Kirk. Chapman around to third. Smaller gap. Santiago Espinal going to left, carrying back, and that one is gone. Forget about it. Espinal for two. It's four to one. Good everyday player. Terrific defender, no matter where you put him. And a base hitter to right field, right here. Hernandez around third, racing home, the throw to the plate, and they don't get him. 
Tay plate. And there he goes. And it's poked into right center, a base hit. Chapman to third. He's getting away from Luis Rivera. There is no throw to the plate in time. A double clutch. Play starting a double play earlier in the game, but he's on the board. There it is. Every Blue Jay with a base hit as Bichette comes in to score. And You'll hear more about his aunt and his family's journey to the U.S. Guys. Hazel, thank you. Looking forward to that and looking forward to this. Santiago Espinal is going to circle the bases. His seventh home run of the season makes it five to two. Yeah, not out of it yet. That was a hanging breaking ball. Santiago had a good at bat last time, but ended up striking out on a long at bat. Swinging through a pitch, doesn't miss this one. Looked like an off speed. The one two. Swing a line drive. Caught by the leaping Espinal right up the middle of the diamond. Espinal went flying into the air. Full extension. Legs kicked out. Air Espy rips it out of the sky. Santiago Espinal was standing on the third base side of second there. Just perfectly positioned.